Hello there. We've some very windy weather around this weekend and those strong winds are actually causing some quite interesting cloud formations. This is the view from space. You can see an almost fish-like pattern there across the UK and that's caused by those strong winds bouncing over the hills and mountains. At least it means a bit of sunshine for many of us. Still a few showers around, wintry ones for the Scottish hills. And those strong winds gusting 50 to 60 miles per hour or more across parts of northern Britain. So could cause a few problems. So a cold feel in the north, but further south it's actually quite mild out there. 11, possibly even 12 degrees through this afternoon. Now as we go through this evening and overnight, those winds will tend to ease down a little bit and there'll still be a few showers around but for many of us it should be largely dry overnight but then later on as we head towards the morning we'll start to see some outbreaks of rain moving in across northern Britain again with some sleet and snow for the Scottish hills and to the north of that it could be cold enough for a touch of frost even some icy patches for the far north of Scotland but for most of us it will generally be a fairly mild night. So we start off Sunday morning then still with a fair bit of cloud around and some damp conditions I think generally particularly for northern parts of Britain some showers there across the Scottish mountains. As we head further south we'll again Again, there will be a fair bit of clouds, some bits and pieces of uh, patchy light rain here and there. But for many of us, it should be a dry start to the day. And you'll notice a fairly mild start as well, with temperatures even in the morning up at around 8 or 9 degrees. But still fairly windy at this stage. Now, as we go through the afternoon, we'll tend to find that cloud breaking up once again. So some good sunny spells coming through for many of us. And just a few showers lingering on here and there. Those winds continuing to ease down through the day. As far as the temperatures go for Sunday afternoon, we'll be looking at highs once again in the north around six or seven degrees but it stays mild further south at 10 or 11. Now as we head into next week a few changes on the cards. On Monday those isobars really opening out so winds no longer a problem but they'll be picking up once again as we head into midweek as these weather fronts come rattling in and these will be bringing quite a substantial dollop of rain with them. So Monday looks like being a largely dry day for many of us. Some sunny spells here and there. Like I said the winds won't be quite as strong. Top temperatures 6 to 10 degrees but by Tuesday it's all changed and we're going to see quite a lot of wet weather whisking its way through the country. So a big change there. Top temperatures which is once again though in the south still at around 10 or 11 degrees so lots going on but you can keep up to date of course as always by checking out our website